As successive governments make conscious efforts to expand the country's healthcare system, the services of professionals, including diagnostic medical scenographers and medical radiographers, would be in demand. But training of these allied health professionals is coming at a cost. Private institutions in this space are asking government for tax incentives and soft loans. Founder of Clean Taps College of Health and Allied Services Sciences, Professor Philip, disclosed this when Casona Global Imaging Limited donated ultrasound equipment to schools at Clago. There's more in the following report. Allied health professionals are integral parts of healthcare delivery. Training of such professionals, including diagnostic medical sonographers and medical radiographers, is said to come at a cost currently taking a toll on private institutions which are into allied health with cost of equipment being chief among contributory factors. To ensure the private sector is able to help in training qualified professionals, founder of Clintops College of Health and Allied Sciences, Professor Flip Nigoleku, is asking for a helping hand from government. Receiving the ultrasound equipment at Clagon in the Tema West Municipality, he says, Private institutions can train more professionals when they're able to access soft loans and tax waivers. Yes, so um, the support can come in varied ways um, in terms of tax incentives, in terms of, uh, you know, very much incentivized um, loan packages with low, you know, low interest rates and so on even with uh, maybe a vehicle, a bus or something to support the institution. So for that, um, the government is fully aware that they can do a lot to support us. And so if uh, that comes, we, we, we will be very, very grateful. Professor Philip Nigoleku encouraged government to help private sector players. He added that role of allied health professionals would be critical in government's Agenda 111 health policy. But I think it can be a shared relationship where government should look at some of us who have dedicated ourselves to the training of these health professionals, especially in the face of anticipated more um, health um, institutions, hospitals. The government to took a bold step to um, implement the Agenda 111 um, uh, program. And this means that they were anticipated to build about 111 district hospitals. Even if uh, a few are completed, it's going to take uh, for to be able to get the requisite professionals to work in the institutions. Meanwhile, sales lead for Casona Global Imaging Limited. Gladys Tete says such equipment will help the school in training the students. According to her, the company's support is not limited to only private institutions. It's to support and push those who are already doing the good work. And we believe that Clean Tabs is doing a very good job. Being one of the private universities in uh, allied sciences, we think that we need to give them the necessary push that would uh, lead them to where they are trying to go to. We know and we, we can see that Clean Taps is on a mission to do great things and definitely we want to be part of this great story. And that's why today we decided that uh, in support of their mission to have an extra ultrasound machine, we decided to donate one of our own portable equipment from MyDre. So this is a, a step in the right direction, that's what I would say. And as long as we are in this country, Ghana, operating, we know that our support knows no bounds. We're willing to support any institution that uh, aligns with our mission and our vision. Casona Global Imaging Limited says, supplying such equipment in the country is to ensure quality health solutions.